Have you ever been sewing along and it just sounds like your machine is growling at you, it's kind of snagging, and it doesn't sound like it's doing much. And it looks okay on the top, but when you take it out, you notice you have that hairy mess on the back. So this is not a tension issue. Well, it is, but it's not. It's actually an operator error issue. And I'm gonna show you a quick little test so you don't have this happen to you. So what happened here is that I didn't have my thread in the tension discs. So it means when I threaded it, I either threaded with my presser foot down and those discs were closed and the thread never got down where it was supposed to be, or maybe I just threaded the machine too gentle. So I came down, but I didn't actually thread the machine with some purpose. And so when I went ahead and lowered the presser foot, the thread was really loose. So see how it, it's supposed to be loose when it's up, but it's supposed to be tight when it's down. When the presser foot's down, you should be able to pull on the needle and it shouldn't pull your thread out at all. So by re-threading the top of the machine, you can see if you've actually threaded it correctly by doing that little pulling on the thread tension test. And I guarantee that this will solve all of these issues that you've had. We get people bringing their machine all the in all the time and they'll say that this thread, you know, the, the nest on the back or the, the big loops on the back of their fabric. Well, a lot of times it's just them not knowing how to thread the machine. But over time, sometimes things build up in that area and just it can't keep the thread held in. So if it's been a while since you've had your machine service, that could be another issue of why you're actually getting this result.